St. Patrick's Day falls on a Sunday this year, providing those who want to celebrate Ireland's most famous saint more time to take in the festivities. While the opportunities to eat corned beef and drink green beer will be plentiful, the Virginia State Police also encourages Virginians to designate a sober driver if you plan to be drinking over the holiday. Now, the state police said drunk driving is not only deadly, but it can be costly. If caught drinking and driving, you could face jail time, in addition to losing your driver's license in your vehicle, and pay up to $10,000 in attorney fees, fines, car towing, higher insurance rates, and lost wages. In 2023, the week of St. Patrick's Day, there were 124 crashes involving alcohol in Virginia. 66 people were injured and six were killed. Colonel Gary Settle, the superintendent of the Virginia State Police, said St. Patrick's Day can be a fun time to have a pint, but remember getting behind the wheel when intoxicated is no way to celebrate. He added that driving drunk is a choice, a choice with deadly consequences for you, your passengers, and every other motorist that's sharing the road with you. The Virginia State Police says that if you're planning to party, then you need to have a plan, and that includes making sure that you have a designated sober driver. Always remember that buzzed driving is drunk driving. Remember, if you are walking while intoxicated, that can be deadly, and that's because of a lack of attention. If you do see a drunk driver on the road, you can call pound 77 or 911 on a cell phone. If someone has been drinking and is about to drive, then you should take the keys and help them get home safely and keep an eye out for pedestrians. To further prevent traffic deaths and injuries during St. Patrick's Day, as well as the traditional spring break season, the Virginia State Police will be participating in Operation CARE, which stands for Crash Awareness and Reduction Effort. Operation CARE began on Saturday, March the 9th, and will conclude at midnight on Sunday, March the 17th.